Well, this, this exhibit uh, is called The Old Plesiosaur and the Sea. Uh, it features a plesiosaur, which is a, a large marine reptile fossil from the Cretaceous period, so from the end of the age of dinosaurs. And this is a fossil that was uh, collected and prepared by Wayne Buckley, who's an amateur paleontologist. And uh, I invited Wayne and, and Kevin Conlon the ceramic artist who uses fossils in his ceramics to loan us material to be featured in the exhibit. Everything in this exhibit is from Manitoba, so, so we're really featuring some particularly beautiful fossils, things like this, this big fish behind me that I think is, is quite stunning, and this is one that, that Wayne has loaned us. Ichthyodectes was uh, a free-swimming fish that, that, uh, that probably ate well, probably ate a lot of things swimming in the seas. This is a fish that went to pieces on the seafloor after death, so probably disturbed by scavengers, maybe currents a little bit. We have a small case, which is a fabulous seabird that is actually pretty much complete. They're super rare things because birds are so fragile. Birds fall apart. So to get a, a complete bird like this is pretty wonderful. And if you look up close, you can see all the, all the details of the jaws there. And then if you want to really see all the bones, you can look at the x-ray that's right below it. We have clams. We have some uh, nice leg bones of one of the big seabirds. We have a, a variety of shark material. There are quite a few shark teeth in some deposits. And here we have a, we have a, a couple of nice examples of vertebrae. Well, I think a lot of museums have these sorts of collaborations. Certainly, certainly the more informed museums do. And borrowing uh, these specimens from Kevin and Wayne, it's exciting to see the real objects. It gives you a connection that's so much stronger than seeing a picture in a book or, or seeing something on your phone. Really, it's a whole range of beautiful fossils. So I think to have these seen and appreciated.